Child took over one developed city. Officials tracked down and tranquilized this black bear that was wandering around downtown Fort Myers. It's raising the question, how does this guy even get here? Wink News reporter Annalise Iraola joins us live in downtown. And they captured this bear, tranquilized it. Where did they take it, Annalise? Lois, FWC officers relocated the bear to state lands, not in Lee County. But just this morning, the bear was right here behind the fence at this business. And it took hours to catch the bear before he was sedated. Right off Victoria Ave and Broadway in downtown Fort Myers, someone spotted this guy, a Florida black bear at a business he didn't belong in. So I'm watching the news. I recorded it. And there's, I'm looking at my trailers. <laughs> and so after, right after that, I said, you know, let's go. Mickey Rosado, owner of Appliances to Go USA, started his day like usual. But what he didn't expect was to see his own business on Wink News. So I said, okay, stay calm. And um, I said, let me drive there. The officer was already sitting here watching it, not keeping the eyes off it. It was a 350 pound male black bear trapped inside the fenced yard it climbed into. They found the bear, it was moving, and so they kind of tracked it and followed it to this location behind us. Um, and then at that point, uh, they had given us a call, and so we started um, scrambling some officers to get down here. The bear didn't want to go into the trap on its own. Ultimately, we could tell from the, the atmosphere here, a lot of noise and a lot of um, stress added to that bear. It didn't seem interested at all in eating. And so we decided it probably best to take action. So FWC officers had to tranquilize the bear. Eventually, the bear went down and officers stepped in. <laughs> FMPD and FWC officers even posed for a photo while they carried the big bear to its trailer. For Rosado, he's happy everything turned out OK. I feel great. I'm very at peace. I'm at ease that everything was so smoothly done very professional. But again, you know, we invaded their territory. <laughs> so you're sympathetic to the I am very sympathetic, yeah. Okay. Not not at all. Not at all. It's not a wasted day. It's actually a joyful day mm -hmm. that everything went well. Rosado had to close his store for a few hours this morning, but as of this afternoon, it's back open for business as usual. He said he's actually thankful the bear chose his business to stop at because these tall fences kept the bear contained versus roaming loose on the streets of Fort Myers. Live in downtown Fort Myers, on Elise Iraola, Wink News.